Well, the first thing we've got to do is recognise that consumers aren't a hom homogenous group. Uh, there's a lot of granularity among the different groups of consumers and there's a lot of uh, differences between consumers. So identifying the different groups and interests is important and then communicating with those different groups where they are in a language they can understand. Listening is really important. Taking feedback, providing solutions or answers to the, the issues that are raised and continuing the dialogue. So this is not just a one-off exercise, it's an ongoing exercise. That's important to build trust. What was missing for me um, was some concrete examples of putting consumers at the centre of the process. So we did talk a lot about that today. We talked about principles and approaches and methodologies, but I didn't actually see a case study that said, this is what we did, this is what happened, and this is the outcome. And I would really like to have seen some of those sorts of examples um, demonstrating what we were talking about and the fact that it can be successful if done properly or can fail if not done properly.